Space is vast. It's teeming with stars, planets, and mysteries we are only beginning to understand. While it may seem like the stars are fixed in their place, they are constantly moving, dancing to the tune of gravity. Sometimes these cosmic dancers get a little too close for comfort. Millions of years ago, a foreign star paid our solar system a visit. This wasn't just a flyby, it came close enough to leave its mark on the outer reaches of our cosmic neighborhood. This wasn't a collision, but a close encounter of the stellar kind. Imagine a rogue star minding its own business when it felt the gravitational pull of our sun. This pull drew the star closer and closer until it brushed past our solar system, leaving a cosmic wake in its path. This event, though millions of years in the past, still echoes in the orbits of distant objects in our solar system. It's a reminder that our solar system is not an island in space. We are part of a dynamic and ever-changing galaxy, and sometimes those changes come in the form of unexpected visitors. To understand just how close this stellar encounter was, we need to talk about the Voyager probes. Launched in 1977, Voyager 1 and 2 are humanity's farthest flung emissaries. They've traveled billions of miles, venturing beyond the orbit of Pluto and into interstellar space. These spacecraft carry with them golden records, messages from Earth to any alien civilization that might encounter them. Voyager 1 is currently the most distant human-made object from Earth. It's a testament to human ingenuity and our desire to explore the cosmos. But even at these incredible distances, the Voyagers are still well within the Sun's gravitational influence. They are tethered to our star, bound to it by an invisible force. The star that passed by our solar system, however, came closer than even these distant Voyagers. The star that grazed our solar system came within 0.8 light-years of the Sun. That's about 5 trillion miles, a distance that makes the Voyager probe's journeys seem like short hops across the park. To put it into perspective, a light-year is the distance light travels in one year, which is about 5.88 trillion miles. This means the star came within a hair's breadth of our solar system on a cosmic scale. This close encounter wasn't just a celestial spectacle, it had a real and lasting impact on our solar system. The star's gravity, though weaker over such vast distances, was still strong enough to tug at the objects in the outer reaches of our solar system. This gravitational tug-of-war left its mark on the orbits of distant comets and asteroids, sending some careening off into new trajectories. Gravity is the architect of the universe. It's the force that holds galaxies together, shapes the orbits of planets, and even dictates the fate of stars. When the foreign star passed by our solar system, its gravity interacted with the sun's gravity in a cosmic dance. This interaction created ripples in the fabric of space-time, much like dropping a pebble in a pond creates ripples on the water's surface. These gravitational ripples, though subtle, were strong enough to disrupt the delicate balance of the outer solar system. Objects in the Oort cloud a vast reservoir of icy bodies that surrounds our solar system would have been particularly vulnerable to this cosmic tug of war. Section 5. Backward Moons One of the most intriguing pieces of evidence for this close encounter is the existence of moons in retrograde orbits. Most moons in our solar system orbit their planets in the same direction that the planets orbit the Sun. But some moons, particularly those around Jupiter and Saturn, orbit in the opposite direction. These are known as retrograde moons. These backward-orbiting moons are like cosmic anomalies. Their existence suggests that they were not formed in their current positions, but were captured by their host planets at some point in the past. The gravitational jostling caused by the passing star could have knocked these moons out of their original orbits, sending them on a collision course with the gas giants. Section 6. 
simulating the cosmos. To test this theory, researchers at the University of Zurich and Leiden University turned to computer simulations. They created a virtual model of our solar system and then simulated the passage of a star similar in size and trajectory to the one that is believed to have passed by millions of years ago. These simulations allowed them to study the gravitational interactions between the star, the sun, and various objects in the outer solar system. The results of these simulations were striking. They showed that the passing star could indeed have captured moons into retrograde orbits around the gas giants. This provided further evidence that our solar system had a close encounter with another star in the distant past. Section 7. Sedna's Story The influence of this stellar flyby extends far beyond the orbits of moons. Sedna, a dwarf planet discovered in 2003, has a highly elliptical orbit that takes it far out into the distant reaches of our solar system. This peculiar orbit is difficult to explain by the gravitational influence of the Sun and the known planets alone. However, the passage of a nearby star could have provided the gravitational nudge needed to push Sedna into its current orbit. This suggests that the star's influence may extend even further into the Oort cloud, shaping the orbits of countless icy bodies. Section 8 Cosmic Dance The close encounter with this foreign star millions of years ago was not a unique event. Our galaxy is in constant motion and stars are constantly shifting positions. It's likely that our solar system has experienced numerous encounters with other stars throughout its 4.6 billion year history. Some of these encounters may have been even closer than the one that disrupted the outer solar system. These cosmic encounters are a reminder that our solar system is not static, but a dynamic and ever-evolving system shaped by the forces of gravity and the movements of stars. Section 9. Echoes of the Past The study of these past stellar encounters is more than just an academic exercise. It helps us understand the forces that have shaped our solar system and the delicate balance that keeps it stable. By studying the past, we can gain insights into the present and even make predictions about the future. The cosmos is full of wonders, and sometimes those wonders come knocking at our doorstep. The close encounter with a foreign star millions of years ago is a reminder that our solar system is not an island in space, but part of a vast and interconnected cosmic web. And as we continue to explore the universe, we are sure to uncover more evidence of these close encounters and the profound impact they have had on shaping our little corner of the cosmos.